the earthquake that uh, struck uh, Haiti on the 12th of January, as we all know, dealt a, a really a cruel blow to a country that had recently made uh, progress in the security, political, and economic fronts. Uh, striking at the political and economic heart of the uh, country, decimated not only uh, its people, but also its institutions and its uh, cadre. The earthquake threatened even one of the few things that remained in Haiti, and this was hope. But in the days and weeks following the earthquake, the international community responded with unprecedented generosity. The people of Haiti need to see a continued dividend of the international solidarity and presence on the ground. And to the maximum extent possible, this dividend should be delivered speedily and by Haitians, through Haitians and for Haitians. The international community should be prepared to support Haiti for the long haul. We count on donors' generosity and hope that this conference on the 31st of March will be a turning point for the people of Haiti. Haiti, as, as we're all familiar with, has a, a history of, um, uh, in the past, of, of governments which haven't delivered for their people or been accountable to them. And uh, this is a fresh start, it's a fresh opportunity uh, for everyone to work to get it right. Uh, so let's not, uh, let's not contemplate failure here. Let's say uh, that it's incumbent on all of us to do what we can uh, to support building the capacity to get this right. Around 3.8 billion now uh, for the next 18 months or so uh, to get the recovery and reconstruction uh, started. And I guess you can take it from that that not a lot's been able to do it, be done at, at, at this, uh, this point. Uh, but that gets it started. But uh, yes, the figure the Secretary General is using in the vicinity of the 11 billion would be the longer term uh, ask. I think what we'd be looking for in a successful conference uh, this week is to see this request for the first 18 months substantially met and then to, on the basis of results, to give confidence to the international community to come uh, with uh, more support.